If you are going to succeed tomorrow, make your head sweat. You won't die. You won't die. I was tired of begging, tired of looking for somebody to give me hand me down. I used to climb Okada from Owodiaja to VI. They'll pay, I'll pay 600 naira per trip. I'll wear my suit inside out. Then the raindrops would have beaten on my back. Tell your neighbor I am tired of being poor. You are not rich until you don't have money in your account, in your pocket. It is poor men that carry money. Rich men don't hold money. They call somebody to wire. Say wire. wire. Any money that they give you in check is small money. Small money. Small money. I came to talk to billionaires here. Is there any billionaire in the house? Sit down, cross your legs, say you're in charge. What rubbish. Don't let anybody deceive you. You can become whatever you want to become. You can become it. You can become it. I will show you pictures of me here. I need you to carry an image in your head. Let your brain cells be tampered with. They said I couldn't make it. I came out of Unica with a third class, extra year. I didn't go for NYSA. But today, I have millions of I have thousands of people, thousands of people working for me. I retired three years ago. Retired. At the age of 44. The first statement I will make to you here is the statement my Modoc told me. He said, decisions make men. Decisions make men. If you are not ready to take decisions, you cannot become. Decisions are what make men. In December 2008, I looked at my children, looked at my wife, looked at everybody. I said, no, I cannot continue like this. I said that I need to change the way my family is. How can I be asking Ali to give me Indomie, give me Geisha, Give me bread, give me tea that I'll pay him 3,000 at the end of the month. I said, no, it cannot continue like this. I took a decision that I was going to make 100 million in one year. I wrote it on the wall. I want 100 million in one year. I wrote it on my ceiling. So when I sleep, I look up at the ceiling. It's the first thing I see. When I step by the wall, it's on my wall. On this other side of my wall. On my toilet door, in and out. Everywhere I go to, I see 100 million. Until you see it in your eye, you cannot get it. My computers, every single thing was carrying, I, Upon King, on a 100 million. When a target is defined, direction appears. You are sitting here suffering and punishing yourself because you have not put yourself on that target. You are selling one plot of land. Who one plot help? Oh, come and tell me you are selling one plot of land. I didn't come to talk to millionaires here. I came to talk to billionaires. You will become it. Amen. You will become it. I said to myself that I'm going to start a company. I started a business called Protection Plus. And I said three things will happen there. Security, maritime, and logistics. Nothing starts until you start. When you start, everything starts. So I started the company. Do it badly till you get it. Don't let anybody tell you you must be an expert. Start. Nothing starts until you start. So I started from my bedroom. And I got on the internet. I began to study. I went on LinkedIn. LinkedIn began to show me things about maritime security. So I decided to register in maritime security. While registering in maritime security, I got to combating piracy in West Africa. And I registered there. They were talking about the Gulf of Aden. I don't know what Gulf of Aden was. But anytime they were talking, I saw Somalia pirate. I saw um, NATO. I didn't understand it. Then they began to talk about Gulf of Guinea. I did not know what Gulf of Guinea. But they were mention Port Harcourt. I will put my mouth. Mention Abuja, put my mouth. Mention Lagos, I put my mouth. Anything you know about, put your mouth. 
I began to put my mouth. And I did not know that I was putting my mouth. People were looking at me. People were connecting with me. Then one man woke up one day and said, King, there is a job I have in, um, in this place, in, um, um, between Djibouti and, and, and Mombasa. Can you do the work? I said, yes. Meanwhile, I don't know what Djibouti is. I don't know what Mombasa house. I can do everything. Everything. The only way to get out of trouble is to enter that trouble. I hear you. You will, you will hear trouble. You will hear trouble. Wherever Djibouti is, Mombasa, until you get hungry, you will not stand up. I said, for my children's sake, for my daughter's sake, for my wife's sake, I need to enter trouble. I need to make it ethically. Then the guys told me that I should provide security, that it will cost me 15 days. Now, Djibouti, Mombasa is in Kenya. So I said, okay, no problem. I have a friend in Kenya, which I met on that LinkedIn. And I said, can you do the work? He said, yes, I can do the work for $150,000. My brother and my sister, I did not know that there's a difference between dollars and naira. Hey. So I told the man that, okay, this guy will do the work. He said, no problem. Do I trust him? I said, yes, I trust him. He's my friend. I connected with people. Stop doing things alone. Partnership works. This is what you have been waiting for. Partnership works. I connected with people that knew what they did. So when I spoke to the man, the man said he can do the work, $150,000. I connected them to the guys in Seychelles. They transferred in one day $150,000 to the man. I was driving from, from um, VI down to Owodea Jack. VGC, I will never forget. And I looked at that VGC traffic. I got there and I saw an alert in my phone. He said, King, be advised that I have received the sum of $150,000. Pay your own 10% commission is, is going to be transferred to you. I said, ah. I picked up my Nokia 3310. God bless that phone. And I checked it. $150,000 times $150,000. My phone delivered me. It said error, error, error. My phone could not communicate that. My phone could not calculate that. I said, okay. That's when I checked that 22.5 million passed my head in 24 hours. I said, Chai! never again. Meanwhile, my commission was 2.25 million. My work, I was working in a company. My whole one year salary was 3.6. In 24 hours, I made 2.25 million. I said, we die here in this business. In this business. In this business. The guys in Seychelles called me and said, King, this is what you're going to do. Now, because you have given us a good job, you're entitled to 5% of the deal. 50 times. Dollars, my brother. When I pressed my quinty, my calculator, my phone, my phone said that that was 7.5 million, 2.25 million. That's 9.25 million. 9.25 million was coming my way. How much was my equity? 1,500 naira empty recharge card. You don't need money to start a business. You need brokerage. Look for somebody that has the money, somebody that needs the land, and connect them. Collect your money. That old paradigm that you need money to make money. You need contacts to make money. Connect the dots. Connect the dots. Stop thinking poor. Stop thinking minchomic, morbid, moribund, myopic, and battered. You need to get angry with poverty. Get angry with poverty. This is the strategy for success and hitting your goals. The strategy is define your target first. That is what your vision board is supposed to do. You define where you are going to first. When you define your target, direction appears automatically. And then your direction will connect you to your association. A lot of people make the mistake and want to relate with people first. They want to con uh, uh, um, association first. Then from association, the person will take them anywhere, direction. Then they will go to any target. No, 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 no. When you define your target, direction will appear. If you are going to Port Harcourt and you get to the airport, you have no business with anybody going to Abuja. What is your target? So if you define your target, you cannot be distracted. It's somebody that does not have a target that goes around in circles. But when you have a target, focus is inevitable. 
You are asking me, King, you retired at 44. I started at 37. And I retired at 44. Do your mathematics. In nine years, I got tired of money. In nine years, you can become tired of money. I will show you because I've been there. I am not in nine steps to win. I will show you how I did it. When you define your target, it will ask you who are your customers. You are not born to everybody. You have a specific people. If you are selling shoes to somebody for 100,000 naira, you have no business with poor people that need for 50 naira. You don't do that. What are your customers? Who are they? Specify. Give them a name. Give them a name. If the person is Bola working in a bank, lives in Lekki, that person's name is Bola, works in a bank, he's a manager, lives in Lekki, and owns a car. That is the kind of profile of the people you are talking to. You are not talking to cleaners in the bank. Define your customers. When you define your customers based on your target, you know where to catch them. When I understood that, the business I was doing and I was making thousand in one year, in three months, I was making a million. The picture there shows that lion was looking for food. It was hiding in the bush studying that, that zebra. When he studied the zebra, he does what they call a penetration test. It will chase to see which one is weak. It is not always on the first time you hit a business. Study your market. Study, study your market. What does the market want? Who are your target? Define them. Do you want them weak? Do you want them strong? Do you want them fast? What is your market? That lion studied that zebra carefully, carefully, and then went after the, the zebra. When it had planned, he knows that at 7 a.m. they come to drink water. At 9 a.m. they go out. You know? So by 6.30, I positioned yourself. Have you positioned, understood your target? Where your target goes to eat breakfast? What your target goes to do at gym? If your target goes for jogging by 6 a.m., why are you not jogging by 5.49, waiting for him to pass? Study your target. All of you live in estate. All of you are connected to people. Any morning, rich men go to jog and you are still sleeping, snoring. A poor man. A poor man. When you study your target, you know when you can catch them and you can kill them. That is how it that's how a lion kills. So I studied my competition, studied the matter, the people that are playing at my league. I stopped dealing with local champions. I looked for people that were talking at my level. These companies were the ones that were listening and doing things at my level. I said yes. I was studying them. Every strategy that they did, I read their annual report back to back. I read what they were doing. That in one year, their turnover was 7.4 billion pounds, equivalent of 2.59 trillion naira. Nigeria's budget at that time was 4.44 trillion naira. A company like me was turning over 60% of Nigeria's budget. I said, whatever they are doing, I will do the same thing. I read their report back to back. I read it. I, that became my first law of success. Copy until you become. There is nothing new under the sun. If a man is a billionaire, find out what does he do to make his billions. You'll become it. I hear you. I did everything. So in 2009, I rented that boat because it was maritime sector. The one up there, 150,000 naira a day. From Ogogoro water side there. Those of you that know the maritime, that bridge, a co bridge. There, under the water, there is called the Gokuro Water Side towards Takwa Bay. I rented it to work. In one year, I started renting this kind of boat, one million naira a day. I didn't have to pay for it because I studied the contract. The contract says after you have done that you can put your invoice and they'll pay you 30 days later. So I'll make an agreement that I'll pay the person that owns the boat 45 days later. So when they pay me, I have 15 days to play with the money and I pay the man off. So I did that for two, three years. I got tired of renting people's boats. Then on, the, on 2015, I bought my first boat. Cash. 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 Your problem is not your location. Your problem is your thinking. Stop talking to poor people. It's a waste of executive time.
If you can think enough, what you have is more than enough. About 10,000 youth and entrepreneurs will be in attendance. Of the greatest Nigeria students. Five speakers and seven panelists. How do you want to start your year 2020? How do you want to start your year 2020? If you are still satisfied in that Christmas staff your house, so be it. Networking like you've never seen before. Temptation has already started. It's not business as usual. We're breaking every rule. A new level of motivation in life coaching. Wakanda forever. Nothing do you. Six tribes, one body, different expression. Register for Tinkation and join a tribe. I've been inducted. In my fault. Guess who? Pinkation. Pinkation. Sweet sensation. Pinkation. It's temptation. I'm not crying. I swear to God. Say you are Tinkation and make sure you are registered. Let's break the rules. Breaking the rules.